Welcome back to another episode of Shea TV. My name is Marissa Hill, and today we're gonna to be talking about a Nike Dunk Low, and this is actually a premium Nike Dunk Low, and this is the special edition Valentine's Day colorway. Let's take a quick sneak peek. unboxing and review if you're new to the channel welcome be sure to hit that subscribe right now give this video a thumbs up if you have any comments or questions feel free to leave those down below hit that notification bell because we do have a ton of heat coming out that i don't want you to miss out on also be sure to check out that join button for our amazing membership perks as well as our merch store today we're going to be talking about a special edition a nike dunk low premium and these are the valentine's day special so for those of you who don't know there are going to be a ton of valentine's Day special drops for Nike this year. I feel like this is the most I've ever seen in different silhouettes. So this will be the only dunk to release. You will see an up-tempo, an Air Trainer 1, as well as an Air Max 90, and a couple of the uh, Air Force 1s in two different colorways, as well as a 1985 Dunk High. So lots to choose from. In my opinion, I feel like the Dunk Low here is probably at the top of the list of the best looking ones to release. I would say going down in second place is the Air Force One in that cream colorway that has the heart de detailing on there. I think that that is a beautiful looking sneaker, but super happy that I was able to cop these early so I can do this unboxing for you. So we'll go through the overview, jump into size and fit, followed by how I style these. And then we will conclude with how much these are going for on the resale market. But obviously these have not had its official release yet. So we'll go through the date of when you can expect to see these dropping on the sneakers app. Let's jump right into it. I really just feel like this is a very crisp, clean sneaker. I love the colorway that they've actually gone with on this. I typically wouldn't think that this would be like my go-to Valentine's day color this honestly kind of reminds me of the wednesday adams lip look this is actually um one of the colors i bought from mac which is the same color she uses it's this really just nice kind of purpley bordeaux but kind of has some hits of that red mixed in there so it is a beautiful purplish red toned color scheme i think that they did such a great job with this complementary color of this cream which is in a tumbled leather so it definitely again is a premium feel so not like a typical dunk that would probably more likely have that smooth leather on the front of the toe box region as we work our way up to the tongue we do have that same kind of purpley bordeaux color scheme on the nylon we've got hits that are hints that are very subtle of this bubblegum pink and then nike in the swish mark in white we also have these bordeaux laces which i think blend quite quite perfectly with that nylon tongue. So let's take a look at those details and then move along to the side paneling.
All right, so wrapping around to the side paneling, we've got a little loose string here that I feel like I need to cut off, uh, but underlays again of that Bordeaux purplish tone and overlays of that tumbled cream leather. And then again, we've got more premium tumbled leather on the swish mark here and that bubble gum pop of pink. As we work our way to the back of the heel, we've got nicely stitched Nike and white on top of the bubble gum pink smooth leather and then the interior is in that bordeaux in bubblegum pink color scheme for the logo wrapping around to the lateral side we still have that same trio of a color combination of underlays of the bordeaux colorway overlays of that crisp tumbled cream leather and then more of that bubblegum pink tumbled leather on the swoosh mark i do think that that is just such the perfect amount of that pink and it really does translate quite well on top of that bordeaux and cream color scheme We're Working our way to the outsole, we've got a nice Bordeaux colorway and the midsole is in that nice cream colorway to complete the rest of the sneaker. All right, let's take a look at those last and final details. All right, so as far as size and fit goes, I typically, depending on what type of dunk, I go up half a size. I decided just for the heck of it to go up half a size in this one. I feel like it does fit quite nicely, especially for somebody like myself who likes to wear thicker socks. I do feel like it's okay to go true to size since this is just a typical Nike dunk low, though it is a premium version, just meaning it has those premium materials, but you don't have that excess backing here that pushes your heel up and the tongue isn't thick as well, which is what you would typically see on an SB dunk. All right, so now let's jump into styling. For this look, I wanted to have fun with the colorway, so I decided to go with this kind of avant-garde dress, and it's got lots of different colors, some that really kind of match the sneaker a little bit, but some that don't. I also wore some gloves that kind of matched this Bordeaux color scheme quite nicely, and then I layered it with a cream coat. So definitely a fun option for a Valentine's Day date. I kept it simple all black so for those of you who are afraid to play with colors this is probably the look for you so I went with this black kind of shorter pea coat I then wore some black shorts with some cute black tights that had little black hearts on them and just a nice lacy boosted top so definitely again if you're not like crazy about going all out with colors in your wardrobe all black definitely goes quite well with these to go with a not too perfect match with the Porto. I went with this nice brown dress, which I feel like brown and cream will go quite nicely if you're not able to match this perfectly. Uh, so this is just a nice kind of subtle different option that's a little bit more of a basic tone and color. So you let me know out of those looks, which was your favorite. Fire, you set me on fire. I would be a liar if I 
said I wasn't on the wire Stuck on every word Looks so good it hurts Baby, you are my desire Higher Take me on a trip I don't wanna miss a second Looking in your eyes Inspired By the way you move All I wanna do Baby, you are my desire So now let's jump into how these are currently doing on the early sale market, I guess you could say, because these haven't had its full debut. So these retail at $120. Currently they're going between $150 to $170. You can expect to see these releasing on February 7th on the sneakers app. Unfortunately, I don't know if you would even get these in time before Valentine's Day. Knock on wood, I would hope you would. Uh, but, you know, definitely I feel like this is a great option. I feel like that one option, the Air Force One, is another second great option. But Nike is definitely giving you lots of different silhouettes to really go after for Valentine's Day. So they're really doing it up for this beautiful Hallmark holiday. So hopefully you'll be able to cop a great pair of sneakers for your Valentine's special day. All right. So now before we conclude, I want to give a huge shout out and thanks to all of you who have participated in our trivia game, which is basically where I ask a trivia question at the end of each video and you all answer in the comment box. So our winner today is Rudrin. I don't know if I butchered that name, but I will have your profile name down below please reach out to me via Instagram, via YouTube, um, or Twitter on messages, and I will coordinate with you to get you your prize sent over. And then we will be completely restarting the board over for the month of February. So good luck to all of you who want to participate in our trivia month. Uh, can't wait to see who will be the new winner for February, uh, at the end of February. And congrats again to Ruren for winning our first trivia trivia challenge. All right, everybody, that is it for this unboxing and review. If you joined us for the first time, thank you so much. Be sure to hit that subscribe on your way out. Give this video a thumbs up. If you have any comments or questions, feel free to leave those down below. Hit that notification bell because we do have a ton of you coming out that I don't want you to miss out on. Also, be sure to check out that join button for our amazing membership perks as well as our merch store. This is Shay TV. My name is Marcel. We'll catch you on the next episode. Wild. Give me see your stars, wild.